At any one time, there are many more full-time roles advertised in the labour market than flexible working or part-time options. This lack of flexible working options disproportionately impacts women, as they are more likely to be looking for jobs that allow work to be combined with caring responsibilities. It's important to understand that this is not just an issue that matters to women. In fact, it's an issue that matters to the vast majority of the labour force. We know from a lab trial that we ran with 5,000 men and women that clear and specific offers of flexible working appeal equally to men and women. Research in behavioural science shows that simple prompts at timely moments can encourage people to change their behaviour. Using this idea, we ran a randomised control trial with the global job site, Indeed. In that trial, we were exploring how nudges like this one could encourage employers to advertise the flexibility on offer in their organisations. In the treatment group, employers saw a screen as part of the advertising process, which made it easy for them to list the flexible working options they could offer. More than 150,000 employers posted over half a million job ads and almost 20 million individual job seeker applications passed through our trials, making this one of the largest randomised control trials ever conducted. So did these simple nudges work? The nudges worked. Timely prompts led to more than a 20% increase in the number of vacancies advertising flexible working options on the Indeed site. On top of that, Jobs that had flexible working on offer attracted between 90 to 30 percent more candidates. Our work with the uh, Behavioural Insights team has led us to make changes in the UK as well as internationally that help fulfil our mission of helping all people get jobs. Check out the full research reports, blogs and other research projects that are part of the Gender and Behavioural Insights programme at www.bi.team and on gov.uk.